Bianca pretty close to her finisher. Oh, oh, she did a low blow. Who? That's, yeah, that's that's legal, but I've never seen it. <laughs> I've never seen it done to a female wrestler. Welcome back to the 10th Owl. My name is Ryan, and this is Donna. And we are doing the triple threat match for SummerSlam between Charlotte Flair, Asuka, and Bianca Belair, which was originally supposed to be Asuka versus Bianca. But and then there was then... supposed to also be a match between Charlotte and Bianca, and Charlotte and Asuka. It, this has been chaos. Yes! And then, at Charlotte's match, Bianca interrupted. Right. And then this match came, yeah, Adam Pierce made it official. Right. So this has been really cool. They, they have not done a lot of good buildups for women's title matches in the past uh, six months plus, probably. So we yes. are going to select the title. This is maybe my favorite match uh, for, for this. I want to make sure we're not... Don't, we don't want to actually we don't want to actually wrestle though they're all fixed not sure what happened there yeah. we're gonna select the title I guess it's gonna be the Can Smackdown I the title? because they don't have the uh, oh she already Charlotte already has it in ours so that's good but whatever we'll go with it because they don't have the new title they've only well, got the, these these here so now nah, let's just go with let's just go with what they have yeah just steal it. That one selected. Are you ready to get in? Yes. Before we do, who do you think is going to win this triple threat match in our match? Probably Oscar. Okay. And who do you think is going to win it at SummerSlam? Mm -hmm. Charlotte. Oh, bold pick. I like it. Let's go ahead and get in. Because Charlotte and Oscar, they're pretty good. Bianca's got uh, a little weird. Yeah, her storyline did get a little bit weird. Um, she's after she now lost it. a bad guy. No, none of them are. But well, Oscar's turned a little bit bad, and we're skipping entrances from from here moving forward. We've seen them all. There's too many. Yeah, the entrances are just too long. So just put it out there for you guys. We're skipping all of them. Yeah, we usually... The one thing we haven't talked about yet, buddy, do you think what? that EO Sky is KOD going to cash already? in? No. Oh. Do you think EO Sky is going to cash in during this match yes. at SummerSlam? <laughs> Interesting. SummerSlam is a popular time to cash in your money in the bank briefcase, but yeah, I just but don't sometimes know. sometimes they cash in at Survivor Series. Yeah, if they hang on it for too long, you know, because the whole way to WrestleMania and whatever, it's just weird. The Money in the Bank is cool as a concept. Whenever it's cashed in, I, I don't know, it's real hit or miss for me. Same. It's like really weird. Yeah, because if they don't do it right, it turns it's not into fun. a bad match. And then if they do it the same night as Money in the Bank, it's like, ah, that was kind of... Like, they didn't have any other good ideas. Oh, take this. Wow! Oh! Oh, that looked painful. Power bombed her on it and then whipped her into it again. Power bomb. Smash her. So I definitely want to see this moving forward with women's oh, title matches. No. I want to... I want to see them actually build a good story. This time they've actually done it. That they need to continue painful. doing it. Right. Right. Because ever since they unified the tag titles for the women, it, like that whole division's gotten weird. And then when they changed the titles for these, it's gotten all a little weirder too. So this is nice. SummerSlam, Brock had that big um forklift. Was that SummerSlam? Yes. Who is against Roman? And then I guess that was SummerSlam. And then he got piled with those tapes. Oh yeah, that was that was not fun. It was yeah. a good match though, but and it was bad. funny because 
he grabbed that forklift and lifted the ring when Roman yeah. was in it. That was cool. <laughs> that was a really good one. Pretty even so far, Bianca's they got the best energy, but she's getting beat up pretty badly now. They're all kind of taking it to each other, which is nice. I think Triple Threat, Fatal 4-Way, and then any ladder match in this are my favorite to watch. Because the matches go crazy. Yeah, the triple threat, so triple threat, fatal four way. Any of the other matches, they they can use weapons oh. and, and all that. There's no disqualification. Shit! Ow! Nintendo sticks going crazy over there. Oh, there we go. If you um get power bombed on the concrete, that's bad. That would hurt a lot. And it's under those pads. This is pretty neat. As they get further down the ramp, the lights focusing on them. I don't remember that being a thing. That's pretty cool. Whoa! Weird submission outside of the ring. That is the thing. So anything goes. You can't pin outside the ring and you can't submit outside the ring, though. I've never understood that in Triple Threat, Fatal 4-Way, or even the No Hold Bar or anything goes. I've never understood it. Yeah. You've never even it has to be a false understood. count anywhere for it to be a pin outside the ring. I don't know, it's a weird, subtle yeah. change. And if it's like an, um, like an underground, no ropes. Oh, yeah, there was one of those recently. That was nuts. Yeah, Damon Cunt versus Eddie Thorpe. That was there. Yeah, it was fun. Oh, another one of them? Standing moonsault. Did that just happen? That was kind of a weird break up there. She never does a standing moonsault. Asuka getting out of the way, getting rid of most of her bar to not uh, be attacked there. Bianca pretty close to her finisher. Oh, oh! She did a low blow. Who? That's, yeah, that's that's legal, but I've never seen it. <laughs> I've never seen it done to a female wrestler. Only to a male. Yeah. That is weird. That is definitely a weird thing to see. Charlotte Flair getting really close to her and signature. Now we know. The yeah, it can happen. Oh, the ref getting just beaten up too. Get out of the way, ref. This is a great start to this match, Val. Another kendo stick. Oh. Kendo sticks are under there. Oh, right on the butt. Ah, uh, yeah. They like to change them up by just painting them when kendo sticks are more or less the same. I guess it could be a little bit harder, but... Like eh. chorus kendo stick, right? It's just a black kendo stick, yeah. Yeah. Just with her designs on it. Right? Yep. Nice front suplex. Into a German suplex. Nice. Oscar well, with her finisher. Basically like kind Charlotte of a with her bridge. finisher. What's up? That's kind of like a bridge, right? That is a bridge, yes. Whenever you do a suplex oh. like that and then go oh, into the pin, that is a bridge, yeah. Oh. Asuka with the lock, but got, she got out. I can do it, it's just hard to do so. Asuka out of the ring. It's been a pretty good one so far. Here we go, are we gonna see the KOD? Here yes. it comes. Yes. We're gonna see a finish? No way. No. No way. She can't get in the ring. She kicked out. Whoa. Nobody has kicked out of that. I don't remember if they have. That move is pretty well protected. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Huh. That's weird. That is very weird. Wait a second. 
Oscar and Charlotte were just working together. That does happen a lot in triple threat matches. It's usually pretty temporary. <laughs> Charlotte has her finisher bank still. Bianca getting close to another. Oh! Right in the face. Oh, she's really going in on her. Who did I say would win this one? Charlotte? What's that? Oh, I said Oscar would win. Oh, Oscar would win ours. That's what you said. Yeah. I, I didn't give a prediction. I don't really give them anymore. Because I don't have a clue. You used to, right? Yeah, now it's... The Roman these matches match, are so crazy. Roman and Brock match, I, I don't know Brock what to say. Win, right? <laughs> yeah. That we did. Brock lost. That was kind of boring, right? Yeah, when when it's more than just the two wrestlers, I have no idea what's going on. When it's one it, wrestler? It's crazy. Even then, it's still crazy. Two? That's fine. If it's four, we don't even this have This match is approaching four stars, so this is already a good match. Yes, three and a half stars. It's been really crazy so far. I hope it stays with it. If it um, lasts quicker, we'll do... Um, I don't think we'll have to. It, it's it's hit the, the time right here where whatever happens, happens with this one. I want to see this more, too, in, in women's matches. 10 to 15 minute matches. Nothing below that. Same thing with men's. I don't want to see these short matches. It's it's no good. Like to Roman's watch. matches no are good. short because he cheats. Ah no, actually his matches tend to be pretty long, and then he still cheats. So, but uh, yeah, what are you gonna do? SummerSlam should be a blast. Last year's SummerSlam was great. The year before that, SummerSlam was amazing. We might have we might have the turn of Bray Wyatt, Randy Orton. Yes. Both of those would be, one of those would be cool, but if both of them John happen, it'd be crazy. John Cena, probably. I don't know if John Cena will show up again. The fact that he showed up at the previous premium live event was a little bit It was surprising. at Money in the Bank. Yeah, that was very surprising. We didn't even know he was coming. No. That was a good surprise, though, right? Yeah, I love those. There we go. Oh boy. But Randy, the Randy Orton one and the Bray Wyatt one have been kind of rumored for a bit. So we'll see if those actually yeah, happen or not. Yeah, they thought Randy and Bray Wyatt would come back at um, um, Money in the Bank. Yes. Yeah, there was but some rumors didn't. there too. So that's that's why I'm like, oh, I don't really know what's gonna happen. Much like actually, this match. Yeah. Ooh. That is a weird neck breaker thing. We have never... Oh! I actually did that a little bit earlier, but it didn't look quite as vicious as that time. Get out of the way, ref! Ref, get out of the... Nice to know the women's refs and the men's refs always annoy. Sometimes, um... Oh. Men's refs are oh, there's like a spear. girls. That's... That might be... No. No way. That's gonna be broken up. So that might be it, but Asuka just, just held out long enough What did she do it? Bianca got in quickly. Oh, jeez. Oh, another KOD. That's not going to be it either. Nope, she's, she's taunting. Get in the ring. <laughs> wow. That was very close. Here we go. Natural selection. That might be it. That's rare too. That move also pretty protective. I kind of like to see her use that move more as a finish than the than the figure eight. Or the figure four. Charlotte is hitting it again. There we go. Nope. Um, what is she grabbing? Another kendo stick. What? Wow, that's too many kendo sticks. <laughs> yes! Bianca's like sweating. 
Oh yeah, they're all, they're all having a go at it here. There's another oh. modified spear. We're gonna see now. Oh, she's doing this again. What is it? Just a power slam. Oh. Bianca going up top. Big elbow drop. That might be it. Charlotte with a neck breaker. No way. Gonna take the win. <laughs> wow. Okay. So that big elbow drop from Bianca put Asuka completely out. She was never getting up. And Charlotte capitalizes. The queen of opportunity capitalizes again. I think you might be right there. I think she might win again. If they do it in this fashion, I think it'll be awesome. She's turned into a face now. She's she's a good it was a good girl. An okay a good guy. It's great. It says. Yeah, uh, four and a half stars, an instant classic. That was a really fun match, pal. Yeah. Did not know how that was gonna end. We had a couple of couple of finishes there that where it could have gotten crazy. Mm -hmm. Should we check the highlights? Yes, we should check the highlights. Let's see what we have. We've got just whatever that was, I don't know. A spear, that was solid. KOD, yep, that was hit early. That spear was vicious. And then the other KOD, which probably should have been the end of it, but wasn't, because she hit it a little late. Man, what a cool match. That spear was very vicious. Yeah, I think this is what's going to happen. I think Charlotte's going to come back and take it again. I think it's it's her time because why not? She's been gone for a while and then comes back and then goes again. I think this is time for her to to really start kicking butt again because now she's she's again she's on the good side. Everyone's on her side now. It's gonna uh, be fun. Not everyone. Eh, everyone seeming seems to like her right now. So should be really cool. Are yeah. you excited for SummerSlam? Yes, are you? Oh, it's going to be insane. It always is. Very. It's right up there to me with uh, WrestleMania. SummerSlam is a blast. So thanks for watching, man. I appreciate it. Can't wait to do the next one. Everyone else out there, stay safe out there. And remember, embrace the chill. Holy crap, that was awesome. Got her again. Oh. I just... Don't want to stop watching that. Me either, man. Thing.